today is the day. It has been brought to my attention that my streaming space has been uh, subpar or a little messy. However, it didn't start that way, but it has become quite the mess. So today we are going to tidy up my streaming space and we are going to relocate it to a new area. Hopefully one that is more eye-catching. I think I'm gonna add some more stuff in the background to give my streams a more appealing atmosphere. What's going on everybody? My name is Hambone. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time tuning in, I would also like to say welcome. Uh, please hit that like and subscribe button if you find this entertaining for you so that you can see more videos from me in the future. All right guys, so let's see what my current setup is and what my plan is to make it look more appealing. So as you guys can see, I am right here in the living room with my setup. There's the kitchen there. Here is my table that I'm using here and my fancy little gaming chair. Um, I have my all my cool stuff here. Uh, I don't know if it's really cool, but my controllers, colognes, whatnot. And then I have my cool little rock collection here that I've been gathering over some time with some camera gear as well. And then uh, all my board games. As you guys can see, I am a really big Razer fan. I have my Razer Ornata Chroma. I have my Razer Basilisk Mouse, my Firefly uh, mouse pad. I have my Razer Nomo speakers on both sides. And actually, I used to have a Razer CPU, but I recently changed it for this one that I have now. It's about the same size as an Xbox. I like to keep everything color coordinated. I'm a very big fan of this blue green kind of shades going on here. I can actually change the one on my computer too. I just haven't done it yet. So as you guys can see, this is my lighting I have here. I have them turned off now because otherwise you wouldn't be able to see. I have my Sony Alpha 7 that I use for streaming. But the biggest problem I have right now is every time I unplug and replug something in on my computer, I get this giant mess of wires and ugh, it's just so annoying. Also, this area is kind of cramped, so I can't really utilize the right side of my desk, but hopefully that will change once we relocate. As you can see, I only have one monitor, which is a problem when I'm streaming because I can't read my chats while I'm in game. I have been using this laptop with my streams loaded on it so that I can read people's chats, but I have to keep looking left and right, which has been quite a pain in the butt. But fortunately, I have purchased a new monitor. I bought this last week. I still have not installed it because I was still trying to figure out where I wanted to put my new streaming setup. So that's gonna be installed today as well. Stay tuned for that. All right, everyone, so let's get started. So I just realized one major problem actually. I don't know if you see this or not, but there's a long ethernet cable that runs down from here from my computer. That ethernet cable actually runs 
all the way across to my routers which happen to be up top there so that I have signal in both upstairs and downstairs. So now I'm gonna have to find a new way to run that cable all the way up into there. Well, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to do some innovative techniques here to figure out where I'm gonna put this wire, because otherwise it's gonna be really annoying if it runs right through the door. I'm thinking maybe running it from here. There's a little gap up there, so maybe if I can run it up through there, then that won't be as annoying. So unfortunately, I don't have a ladder, so you're about to see a man become a monkey. Don't try this out. That was a bit terrifying and also very exhausting. <coughs> but we got the wire ran, so now we can continue. Now here comes the difficult part, taking everything upstairs and setting it up. Let's go. Okay, that's done. Now let's move upstairs and get everything set up. So this little bar here is super annoying when I'm playing. It always bumps my knees and I can't get my chair completely underneath. So we're going to remove that today to give us a little more freedom and a little more leg space. Unfortunately, I don't have a hammer or a screwdriver, so we need to improvise. So that's why I have this. Watch closely. This has been Life Hacks with Hambone. So I had to buy some stuff to help me clean up and make everything look good. So I bought this here, cable management something zip ties, cable ties, whatever you guys call them, a couple of hooks, and a much bigger power strip with each one having a fuse. This will help me have more space for all my plugs. So that's useful. Also we're gonna set up this new monitor that I bought, just a cheap one, just one to watch my streams. Uh, I really don't need anything too good. I'm not gonna be gaming on it, it's just for, you know, working or whatever. So, I'm gonna install this as well. All right, everyone, I have finally finished on day two. <laughs> it took a little longer than I thought it did. It would. Uh, I think I stopped at like five o'clock this morning, and then I woke up, and then I had to go buy a cable, and. You've seen my story on Instagram, you know, it, it's been a, a busy day. So I'm going to show you now what it looks like. Alright everyone, it has been like four days since I started this project, so as you can see I keep changing shirts. But yeah, this is it. This is the new stream space of Hambone Vlogs or Hambone Gaming, either or. 
So now I'm in my bedroom. This is where I will be vlogging from now on. It's a better atmosphere and not as echoey in my opinion because of the bed. And honestly, the lighting's a lot better in here. I plan to add some LEDs here on the windows to give it this nice look when I'm streaming. But for now, it's just gonna have to do. All right, guys, this has been my new setup. This is my new workstation in general. Um, if you like what you saw here today, make sure to like and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram, and I will catch you guys in the next stream or video. Take care.